Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a what's in my bag of my new Alexander Wang Rocky and also I've gra grabbed some extra stuff to show you kind of what else fits in it in case you might want to, I don't know, in case you carry other stuff and you want to see if it fits. So let me start off. Um, I got this like a week ago and here it is. It is the Alexander Wang um, Rocky bag in the matte with the matte black hardware, and it is lambskin. Okay, so first off, I paid $406 for it, I believe, and then I ended up, ended up can't talk today, ended up getting a discount um, because it had a chip on the bottom. I don't actually even know where it is now. Yeah, it's just right here. There's a little chip on it right there, and so they gave me a discount, so I ended up getting a to paying a total of $320 for it, which is awesome because Originally, it's $795. So with that being said, I'm going to kind of do like, I'm going to show you what I have in my bag, and then I'm going to show you what fits in it, but also kind of like an overview of it as well, and I'll do a mod shot too. Okay, so first off, no, it's not that heavy. That is, I think, the question most people ask me, and that was actually my question for most people whenever I was looking at it. It is not that heavy. It does sound heavy because I think it's 1.7 pounds, but carrying it, it's not that bad. So when I took it out of the box and I was unboxing it, I said, oh my gosh, it's heavy, it's heavy. But it's not that bad. So I have mainly actually been carrying it like this, you know, um, in the crook of my arm, or I have um, thrown it over crossbody. I did try to carry it over my shoulder, but it's been snowing in like 13 degrees here. So when I've got my jacket on, it won't stay. It actually also probably won't fit me crossbody with my jacket on. Um, but whenever I don't throw my jacket on, that's pretty much like when I'm shopping in the store and everything, that's when I've been wearing it like that. And I will show you what it looks like too. But first I'm gonna show you what's in it and kind of the overview. Um, so with it being matte black, it does say on the Alexander Wang website to be careful um, because it does chip easy, but seriously, like it really does. That is with its own clip. Um, you can, I don't know if you can see that. There you go. You can see that it's already chipped off the matte black there which I don't really care, but I know most people would. Um, but so if that bothers you, I would go with something like the rose gold, gold, nickel, whatever else they have. Um, but that has already shipped off there. This also does pop off too. Um, and I actually don't know how because the clasp is on there pretty well, but I have tried to pick it up and all of a sudden my strap is flying off because it did come, the clip did come off. This side over here has three holes that are extremely tight. <laughs> I'll hold my tongue on that one. And it is hard to get that through there. So I haven't moved it. I moved it when I first got it and I haven't moved it again. Um, it has this little movable thing on it which doesn't make a difference to me. So um, you can use it. I guess I kind of put it there but it doesn't seem to make a difference. The zipper is really hard to zip. If you can see how I'm struggling to get it on. I usually don't close it though. But that's, if I close it, that's as much as I do. Get it closer. But I really don't close it. I pretty much leave it not all the way open, but pretty much open. So like that. And this is how full I have it right now. So as of right now, let me show you the outside actually first. There are two pockets on the outside. There is one over here. And inside it, I've got some cash. I've got two perfumes and I have my dog's tags so that is all I carry in there I'm just gonna <laughs> put it back in there because I am still using it and I'm not gonna change out of it so I'm just put that back in there and these are kind of hard to close they get stuck at the bottom on the other side this is the one that's smaller the other one goes all the way across but this one's smaller so I've got like a pack of gum in there I've also got of course which I always have been carrying these with me. I've got some candy. And I just kind of shoved this candy in here and then on the side because this pocket right here opens up to the side too. So I shove the candy over there and then I shove the gum in there. Okay, so, oh, I'm gonna tell you the measurements. I think I had it somewhere. I dropped it on the floor. Okay, so the measurements are 10 inches in length. Right here, I dropped it again. <laughs> okay. So it is 10 inches in length, seven and a half inches high, and then seven and a half, seven and a half inches wide. 
The handle strap right here is four inches and the removable strap, it says it's 21 inches. It doesn't specify if that's the drop or if that's the length, but that's gotta be the drop. So, okay. And currently on the Alexander Wang website, this bag is 556. They do have some that are actually 477, but um, I think they are, I think it said suede nubuck on there. There's like a green, there's like a reddish color, reddish brownish color on there. So, and a ton of um, mini Rockies. Okay, so inside I've got a scarf that I just threw in there when I was done with it. I have sunglasses case, thing of cash, I've got hand sanitizer, I've got a necklace that my daughter's had, they were, they were playing with it, they broke. It's a handmade necklace, so turds. I've got two Target receipts. I have a Rubik's Cube that I bought today, and these are freaking impossible. So I've been trying to do those. I think, me and I was looking up the cheat, and I can't even do this with the cheat. So, okay, so next I've got some Kleenexes. I have my little thing that carries my cash. I've got um, Louis Vuitton, key, or Louis Vuitton clay, full of change actually. So. This thing is freaking full. So with this in here on top, it's still not that heavy. Got a thing of hair dealies. Some Bose headphones. Coupon. My purse is not usually this messy either. It's just because this thing is so small. I don't can't like make compartments. Got my regular glasses. I have um, Sephora brush. Hobby Lobby receipt. Another coupon. A pen some EOS, and another piece of candy. I've got, and then the pocket, there's two pockets Why you can't really see that. Over here, I usually keep my phone, and then in this pocket right here, I've got my pocket organizer right there. Love that thing. And then the zipper, which, okay, so the zipper is not very big, and you can see that the zip part like sticks out some. Inside there, I've got lip gloss. You really can't fit much in here either. It is literally the size of, um, Lip liner, so a lip liner. <laughs> a pin, so it's two pins. Got sunblock, it's actually a lot of stuff in here. Um, lotion, lip gloss, floss. I have Tide to go pin. And I have a tampon and a fingernail file. So, and that is literally all I've got in there. So that is it. Oh, I um, also noticed when I was zipping, I'm not sure which side it's on. But, one of these actually, yep, right here. It's already chipping on the thing. So, I don't know if I said calfskin. These are not calfskin. This one, I don't know if they're all this, but this one is lambskin. So my husband is constantly making fun of me saying that I'm carrying a dead lamb. Which is really awful because I absolutely hate that. Not. I hate the fact that I'm carrying anything that is skin. I mean, but my Louis Vuittons are too. I mean, they're canvas and leather. But is it is calf skin like really a baby? I would like someone to clear that, clarify that for me because I feel really awful. <sighs> but that's what he said. Anyway, so it has all the studs on the bottom and I just love them. That's probably my favorite part. Um, but it does scratch really, really easy but it wasn't that bad. I hit it on, I, we went grocery shopping and as we were leaving, I was moving something in the basket and there's like a brick wall and I hit the brick wall with my purse. Oh my goodness. Um, where is it actually? Maybe it's not, it's very small actually. It did seem like it was gonna be really bad. Um, it was right here, you can't even see it. It just, yeah, I kind of licked my finger and it's still, I can wipe it a little bit. Um, it just kind of like scuffed it a little bit. But it's not that bad. So anyway, so it does probably scuff pretty easy, but yeah. So, okay, so full size wallet. Here's a Sarah wallet in here. So that fits, let me zip up that pocket. Here we go. Fits perfect, with lots of room. So I'm gonna kind of put stuff on top of that. This is my iPad, it has a case on it. So semi-thick case. I don't wanna take it off because it's too hard to put it back on, but let's see if that fits. Fits perfect, that's pretty much like the width with two or three inches on the end. So there it is. 
We're dog sitting if you can hear that dog crying. <laughs> Here is a cosmetic pouch. I'm gonna put that in. Let me move that to the side. Let's see, put that in there. So that fits perfect as well. Let's see, I'll show you what a water bottle would be like. Here's a full water bottle. Make sure it's closed. And that would fit in there if, oh gosh, this thing keeps closing, if you laid it down, which that'd be really if you don't carry very much. But yeah, so a lot of stuff fits in here. See, it's pretty good. I didn't think that the iPad would fit, so that's really good. Um, I have been asked if um, what it compares to, I would have to say it compares to the Speedy 25 um, because I have the 30 and as I showed in like many, many videos, so much stuff fits in there along with like my Neverfull pouch, um, all this junk. And then also the cosmetic pouch, all that fits in there perfectly. There's no way all that would fit in here. If I were to put all this back in here, the iPad wouldn't fit, the full-size wallet wouldn't fit, and the pouch wouldn't fit. I also could not get the Neverfull pouch to fit in there. I did try, but it was just too tall over here on the back. So that definitely doesn't work. Um, but it pretty much is exactly like the Speedy 25 I found. Pretty much what I fit in there, I can fit in here. The only difference is this um, actually opens better. I prefer the opening like this. I obviously, I like the zipper of the Louis Vuitton, and I like my Louis Vuitton better. But as far as the openings go, this makes it where you can fit more. So if, I don't know, I don't know what to say. You can't really compare them because they're two different kinds of bags. They're two different brands, two different everything. So I like them both. Um, I would I would suggest it. I don't see anything wrong with it. People have said that they're too heavy, that they don't like them because of the weight, and that they, you know they've gotten rid of them because of the weight. And if you're really sensitive to weight, that might be an issue for you. But I guess I'm just used to carrying so much stuff that it really isn't that big of a deal to me. I think that the Rocco would probably be too heavy because it being 3.7 pounds I feel like that is just enormous that's like a child I would like to hold it and see what I honestly think because after watching some people's reviews like makeup by Tiffany D she says it's not that bad and I mean personally I can't imagine it not being that bad but I mean she carries a lot of stuff so maybe it really isn't too heavy. Okay, so let me get all this back in there. I'm gonna show you what it looks like, completely full and wearing it. I am wearing a hoodie, so imagine I'm wearing something smaller. And I'm 5'5", 128 pounds. So, my, the handles do not hang down. Let's see if I can zip it. This is why I don't zip it. This is super, it's super hard to zip. That would definitely be a con, because it's really hard. And mine hasn't gone in very much. It was folded when I got it, but so far mine isn't like going in too badly. Okay, so <clears throat> here it is. Let's see, it's got these two little things. This doesn't stay there either, just FYI. Mm -hmm. So this is it like this. Just hangs kind of, my waist is right here. So you can see it right there, mm -hmm. waist high, like this. Or you can wear it, cook up your arm, which is pretty much how I carry it. And that's actually really comfortable. The weight distributes really well. And then we have crossbody. Let's pull this down. So there we go. You can see that these are pretty much up. I've seen other people's where they flop down. So maybe it will with time. But it's actually really comfortable. I like where it sits like this whenever I've shopped with it like this, which I did a lot recently. I just did a tried to do a vlog, um, it was really, really comfortable. So I really liked it. Um, I had no problems with it whatsoever. It was super comfortable like that and not heavy on my shoulder. So there it is. That is the Alexander Wang Rocky Bag in matte black. So I hope that I answered all the questions that I was asked on Instagram. Um, if you have any more questions, I guess, leave them down below and I will try to answer them. And anything else? Um, yeah, I also, I, as I was trying to say, I was doing a, um, I'm trying to do a vlog. I'm trying to record myself doing, you know, daily stuff. Um, I'm trying to put that together right now. If anybody has any ideas, let me know because I'm kind of having a hard time with it. I'm not very good at recording myself going around doing things. 
So yeah, if you could leave some ideas, I would really appreciate them. Um, anything you'd want to see that would sound like it would be fun. I don't want to do anything that's forced. So just kind of things that are like daily pretty much. Um, I'm not going to do the gym. I was asked if I would do that because I'm always saying I'm going to the gym, but I can't, I can't do it. I cannot, I don't know. There's too many people at the gym. I can't, I can't do it. I just can't. That's like my quiet time, like music blaring in my head quiet time so anyway if you have any questions or comments leave them down below and any you know ideas you have everyone have a great day